Welcome to Byte Further. Today we'll tell you how to fix iPhone unavailable no erase option. Through Apple's official forum, some iPhone users don't have an erase iPhone option when they got iPhone unavailable screen or security lockout screen. Worry not. After watching this video, you'll know why you have no erase iPhone option when your iPhone says iPhone unavailable or security lockout message. Also, we'll show you how to unlock iPhone unavailable without erase option. Now, let's start. Okay, first, why do you have no erase option on iPhone unavailable screen? Alright. When you get the iPhone unavailable message on the lock screen and you forgot the passcode, Apple will give you an erase iPhone button to quickly get out of the unavailable mode and unlock your phone. Normally, if you keep entering the wrong passcode on your phone in a row more than 7 times, you will see an erase iPhone button appearing on the bottom right corner of your iPhone unavailable screen or security lockout screen. It's just located next to the emergency button. Tap it, tap erase iPhone button again, enter your Apple ID and password, and then your phone will be reset and finally unlocked. However, if you still get iPhone unavailable screen no erase option even after typing the passcode wrong continuously more than 7 times, here are a few possible reasons. First, your iPhone isn't running the latest iOS 15.2 or later versions. Second, there is no SIM card inserted into your unavailable iPhone, so you don't get the erase iPhone option. Third, you suffer an unknown system bug. This could happen if you get iPhone unavailable screen without entering the wrong passcode. Instead, the unavailable error shows up suddenly after charging, updating, or resetting your device. Next, we'll show you how to fix iPhone unavailable with no erase option. There are mainly three solutions. Before moving forward, we got a note for you. No matter which solution you take, you can't unlock and remove iPhone unavailable message without erasing all the contact and data on your device. If you have a backup of your phone, you can restore the backup after erasing your phone. If not, you will lose everything on your phone, including photos, messages, contacts, etc. Okay, the first thing we should do is to unlock your unavailable iPhone with iTunes or Finder. On your Windows or Mac laptop or desktop, open iTunes or Finder. If you don't have the software, go to the Apple website to download it first. Then, use a USB cable to connect your unavailable iPhone to the computer. You should notice that your iPhone neither shows up on the computer nor the iTunes or Finder. Worry not. You can put your device into recovery mode to make contact with the software. Here's how to do that. In iPhone 6S or earlier, press and hold down both the side button and the home button together until you see the recovery mode screen. In iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, press and hold down both the side button and the volume down button together until you see the recovery mode screen. In iPhone 8, X, XR, 11, 12, 13, or newer, press then release the volume up button. Press then release the volume down button. Then, keep holding the side button until you see the recovery mode screen. Just try a few times if you can't succeed in entering into the mode at once. Once done, stay connected to the computer and go to iTunes or Finder software. It should now pop up a dialog box, telling you that the device has a problem and requires you to update or restore the phone. To erase your iPhone that is unavailable, choose the Restore button. Then, click the Update and Restore button. Keep moving forward as prompted to trigger the process of downloading the latest iOS software and erasing your iPhone unavailable no reset option. This will take a while to finish, so please wait patiently. You can track the process with the progress bar showing up on your unavailable iPhone. When it goes to the end, your device will restart and boot up to the Hello screen. It's exactly what you get when you first receive a new iPhone. Just follow up with the setup assistance to quickly set up your phone. If you have a backup for your content, Apple enables you to get back the data from the backup in the apps and data screen. When all is set up, you should unlock and regain access to your phone now. What if your unavailable iPhone has no options for erase or enter the passcode or face ID and you don't have a computer or a USB cable? Can you fix an iPhone that is unavailable without a computer? Sure? You can erase your phone through iCloud.com or Find My App on another iOS device. Both two methods only work when the Find My feature has been activated on your iPhone before it says unavailable. Now, let's begin with going to iCloud.com to fix iPhone unavailable or security lockout if there is no erase option on the screen. Open any browser on an Android or iOS mobile phone or tablet that you can access. Go to iCloud.com. 
Then, sign in with your Apple ID and password that are used to log into your unavailable iPhone. If you've turned on two-factor authentication on your iPhone before, you'll need to enter the verification code. It'll take you into the iCloud dashboard. From the lower right corner, click the Find iPhone icon. Next, click to open the All Devices menu. Choose your iPhone that says iPhone unavailable with no erase option. Then, choose Erase iPhone option. Click Erase button. iCloud will start erasing your unavailable iPhone and deleting everything on your phone. A few minutes later, your iPhone will reboot and the Hello screen shows up. Now, set up the phone from scratch or restore it from iCloud or computer backup. Then, your iPhone is unlocked and available. Another solution to unlock an iPhone that is unavailable without erase option and without a computer is to use the Find My app. Get an iPhone or iPad that you can unlock and get into the home screen. Find and open the Find My app. If it asks you to log in, enter Apple ID and password that you use to sign into your iPhone that says unavailable with no erase iPhone button. When logged in, find and choose your locked iPhone at the Devices tab. Then, swipe up and scroll down until you see the Erase This Device option. Click the Erase This Device option. Then, enter the Apple ID password again and a few seconds later, your iPhone will erase your unavailable device to unlock. How long this process takes may depend on your internet speed. Once done, it'll restart to the Hello screen. Set it up from scratch or restore it from iCloud or iTunes backup. Quickly complete the phone settings and you're able to get into your unavailable iPhone now. If you have tried everything and your iPhone still says iPhone unavailable with no erase option, take your phone to your closest Apple authorized service center to have the phone serviced. That's all how to fix iPhone unavailable without erase option. Hope this video can successfully get out of iPhone unavailable screen or security lockout message and unlock your phone so that you can get access to your phone again. If it does, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.